Hey, good morning. I'm Leah D'Amelio with Mahalo Daily. And you know what? Today, I want to introduce you to our new friendly neighbors. We're high tech here. All you need is an authorized thumbprint. Let's go. All right, I'm talking now with CEO and founder of CauseCast, Ryan Scott. Ryan, thanks for talking with us today. Hi, thank you. Um, tell me a little bit about what inspired you to create CauseCast. Well, um, when I sold my company in 2001, my first company, I was uh, looking to give back. So I started working with a lot of different nonprofit organizations, you know, helping them doing fundraising. And you know, also, because I have a technical background, I would uh, examine what they were doing with their sites and, and how they were using the internet. And I thought I could help these organizations out, but um, you know, just by writing software or, or, or making services for, for one organization didn't make a lot of sense. Uh, so I thought maybe I can make something that will um, help move the needle and, and really help um, a lot of organizations at the same time. Can you tell me a little bit about what it took to actually get this organized and launched? Because you guys are new just a couple weeks ago. Yeah. You went live online. Um, what did it take to put that all together? Well, we've been working on CauseCast since uh, last uh, December. So we had to obviously uh, build a, a robust site in that time uh, with uh, really all the, the features that you, you need to, that you know, that we need to, to be able to offer to people to get started. You know, we have a, a fantastic group of uh, employees, really um, enthusiastic, uh, talented people, um, you know, really, so we're here to be, to be able to, to handle um, everything that needs to be done, which is, you know, making sure that the users have all the tools that they need and the, the celebrities have all the tools that they need and the nonprofits get out of it what, what they need to get out of it. Now I'm talking to CauseCast president, Brian Sergitz. Brian, thanks for talking with us today. It's my pleasure, thank you. What does it take for an organization to get hooked up with you guys? They um, need to uh, be active in, in regards to uh, wanting to have an, be a part of our platform. Uh, what we do is we you know, carefully bring on and look at the different organizations. What we really try to do is have the site be scalable so that, you know, that we don't have one too much of this issue and then not enough of another issue. Now to my right, I have Levi Felix, who's the Director of Creative Development for CauseCast. On the CauseCast site, you actually have your own broadcast. Yeah, so we actually have, uh, we call it the CauseCast, and it's a, it's a weekly news, entertainment, educational show that informs you about, you know, all things cause. So, you know, whether you want to find out what your favorite, you know, leader or celebrity is involved with, or there's an event going on, you know, whether there's news that happens, you know, be related to the causes, you know, connect with it on the CauseCast, and you can watch it and then find out how you can directly take action. So it's fun, it's funny, you know, it's it's educational and really it's you know all encompassing cause. So CauseCast, your source for all things cause. And now I'm talking to the director of business development for CauseCast, Sloan Berent. Sloan, thanks for talking with us. Sure. What are some of the events you guys are involved with now? What can we look forward to? Um, oh. We're definitely going to be doing things here in the LA tech community, so I think that a giving 2.0 is on the way. Uh, we're going to be doing monthly volunteer events and also, uh, you know, kind of a cause drinks, an opportunity for people to come together and, and just talk about what it means to be socially conscious and celebrate and network. Um, we're also planning special events around anything that's, you know, big and going on and, and deserves a voice to have a cause. That could be the election, it could be a big conference or a festival. Is there one cause that's particularly close to your heart? There is. Uh, Generation Rescue. Uh, Jenny McCarthy is, is behind this, and uh, her, you know, Jenny, her, her son uh, Evan was uh, diagnosed with autism when he was was very young. A father whose child was um, who went through the Generation Rescue program, which was uh, an organization that Jenny McCarthy is a, is a board member of. Uh, was had his son started to speak again from the time that he was from not from vaccination to going through the program and you know he calls it his six years of silence so when you actually have and he's like I will do anything to promote what you guys are doing you've given now a form for people to know about Generation Rescue where as opposed to it would take them having to look for it. Now when you sign up on CauseCast you have to put a quotation on your profile what is your quotation? Um, I, th I don't know what my current quotation is but I'm gonna change my quotation to um, you need to redefine what your definition of is is. My quotation is uh, always be learning. We're building a company but it's really about the people that are here. Um, you're looking at causes and how they might affect the environment or affect animals or, or you know global warming but really that boils down to the people and I think how we treat each other so I think my quote right now is people first. For more information go to causecast.org or visit mahalo.com slash causecast. That's it from the Mahalo Daily and CauseCast headquarters here in Santa Monica. 
Change your world and the world will change. We'll see you next time on Mahalo Daily. Yeah! <laughs>I read that you guys are the one-stop shop for uh, philanthropic... No, wait. Let's say that again.